Hey guys, Logan Sneeko here. Got an update on the 2020 Leaf that is in the shop with a bad cell or bad cells. Um, if you're new here, this is what happened. I'm gonna show you the video. Here we go. Got 146 mile range. I got about a 40 mile drive. Let's see what happens. Okay, so I'm going around the roundabout, getting ready to get on the highway. So I'm gonna put a timer here so you can see how long it took me on the highway for this to fail. Now look at Leaf Spy. I'm already up over 500 millivolts and look at these cells. Now look at my power band here. This is the power available for the engine. Those little gray dots are dropping. Look at my range. Look at the battery percentage. This starts dropping like a rock. I'm not even on the highway yet and I already lost half the battery. So I'm accelerating, accelerating. I'm trying to get up to speed. There's semis barreling behind me. And within 30, 31 seconds, I lose, I go down to 6% battery and I get the low charge warning. Here it is. Battery charge, I need to find a charger. It's not, not that low, I just got on the highway. So as I start to increase the regen, I'm gonna increase my range. Notice the range is going up. The battery, the blue bar in the battery is going up. Now I gotta accelerate some more because again, I need to get position and it happened quickly we're talking about a minute and a half pop up turtle mode i lose heat i can't go more than 25 30 miles an hour this thing failed exactly like i said it was going to be fail now here i am again low battery warning and you'll see on the speedometer there's going to be a little orange light pop up here in, in a second in about 20 seconds that's going to be turtle mode when turtle mode comes up it is protection mode for the battery so it there's no more heat to the vehicle all you can do is drive it for about 25 30 miles an hour okay so you can see that that car's running horrible so if you don't know what's going on this is the first video of the series you've watched go back to the beginning watch them and you'll get all caught up i'm not going to go through all the details everything that's going on it's already been documented go back check it out and you'll see what's happened. But as we're standing right now, um, as of January 15th, they've had the car going back and forth. They finally did another test about two and a half weeks ago. I think it was two weeks ago, Monday. Sent it to Nissan, and Nissan came back and finally approved to change out the bad modules, change out the bad cells. So uh, that's where we're at. They don't know how long it's gonna take for the parts to come in, so Hopefully, fingers crossed, they're gonna get the car fixed. It'll be running good as new, and I'll update you as soon as I can. Um, as far as dates and whatnot, I might just put out shorts to tell you what's going on there, but success. We got it. We got Nissan to finally agree that, yeah, there's a problem with this battery, and we need to get it fixed. So they are gonna replace cell number three and number four, and then retest the car. Don't know when that's gonna happen, I'll let, as soon as I find out, I'll let you know. All right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell so you can get the updates as soon as I put them out. All right, as always, thanks for watching. Snow Gas Nico, God bless, and have a great day.